All right, now I'm not sure how many of you guys still own the Galaxy S22 Ultra, whether you have exchanged it or upgraded from the S22 Ultra to the S23 series or the S24 series. I'm still going to update you guys about the new updates that we're going to receive on this device as long as I have this phone with me. Now, this phone has got a brand new update. This is a security patch for January 2024. As you can see, the size is about 400.68 MB and the version number ends with DWL9. And in the change log, we don't see any new changes as usual uh, it's all about stability and reliability improvements and bug fixes as well i have already installed this update and i do not see any new features on the phone let me share you some important information about this phone now, the s22 series was launched in the year 2022 and samsung promised four years of software upgrades and five years of security patches now this phone out of the box it came with android 12 and we have already received android 13 and android 14 which means this phone is still eligible to get another two major android upgrades the android 15 and android 16 and of course another three years of security patches we will still get the fourth year could be quarterly security patch and the fifth year could be biannual security patch so we will still get to enjoy all the brand new features with the upcoming os upgrades in the next couple of years and this phone is a fantastic device but yes there are some issues with this uh, the battery performance is not that great as you all know and i've started noticing some lags here and there compared to how it was about a year ago Maybe I will have to just factory reset the device to get it to a brand new condition and I would suggest you to do that as well. But as far as the battery life is concerned, it does take me throughout the day with normal usage. But if I use it heavily, by evening I can lose close to about 80% or 90% of the battery and it may not last until I go to bed. So that is a concern that I have got on this phone. And even the cameras are not that great compared to the S23 series or the S24 series. And that could be one more reason for which you might want to upgrade from this phone to S23 or S24 series. But if you're someone who do not face any issues as far as the battery life is concerned, and if you're okay with the camera, then I don't think you really need to upgrade from this phone. You can stick with it for about a year or two and then upgrade it to S25 or S26 in the future. That is something I would like to suggest. Now, if you have any questions about this, do drop it in the comment section. I will be happy to answer you guys and the community can also respond to your queries and answer each other for each other's benefit. That's all I want to share with you guys. Let me know whether you have received the update or not drop a comment and be sure to subscribe to the channel there are loads of contents coming up on the s24 series and its features and i'll also be comparing it with the s23 series and s22 series so stay tuned for those videos thanks for watching my name is salian signing off cheers bye bye